Hello everyone, Billy here with another Lego Harry Potter 2022 review, and this one is on uh, Hogwarts Moments Defense Against the Dark Arts class, of course. <coughs> so, so on the front of the box, we have the Lego and Harry Potter logos and Wizarding World logo, of course. Picture of everything going on there, and also, of course, first this set opened up, of course, and all the main things included, and... Recommended ages 8 and up, set number 76397, has 257 pieces. Flip to the back of which, which goes horizontal, of course. You can see that showing that it opens, and of course, on view of the set, and also everything included with that, and also how to switch the faces of Mad Eye Luffy. So, like, which, unlike with the others, that shows collect them all, and of course, but not sure why. But of course, had to use that. Back. Although it could have like fitted somewhere else on this back cover, or but yeah. And now onto this manual. See, same pictures on the front of the box and everything. On, then how to win on the online survey. Then all the pieces that come with the set. And then build and swap of last year's. Uh, Hogwarts sets, of course, and also the Hospital Wing, which next review, of course, and also add for all the sets of this current wave that I'm currently reviewing, of course, but yeah, and then the last building steps. So, on to the mini things, of course. Okay. <coughs> Hang on. Okay. So first off, for the mini figs, we would have Mad Eye Moody, who first time just like Trelawney in the last set we looked at his also can come in this in this set instead of in a collectible minifig series. So good to see in sets, uh, of course, and and of course everything kind of similar to that variant, but also a staff piece same, and of course this globe piece there, kind of, which might be new, probably yeah. And also of course one leg, and of course the legs of which asymmetric, but ones with silver printing, of course, but yeah. And of course, Hermione Granger, uh, which, who is, of course, like we've seen in, same as we've seen in other sets. So, well, she, and also Neville Longbaugh, quite the same as we've seen in last year's Chamber Secret set, so, of course. But of course, outfits kind of the same from that, and mid legs, all the same, but yeah, not much to look at, of course. And as for the back double door, or double side faces and back torso print, obviously well as you can see the back torso printings the same for that of course and one which also quite goodly but in my immediate case as you can see different face print of course and also to get this other hair piece kind of the same as Neville's but in a different brown color of course but yeah So now that is about it with the mini figs here. And now on to the book itself, of course, which as you see, same piece as all the other Hogwarts Moment sets, but in black, of course. And of course, it does have some nice uh, printing on the front cover here. And traditional corner pieces, obviously, and so you have like classic spider piece, wand, newer wands, and also werewolf representing a thing, uh, werewolf lupin, of course. But yeah, 
and then on the spine, or there's the spine, which does have a sticker to tile, of course, and that has two of the new wands pieces, obviously. And on the back, just plain and also extra studs so you can connect it onto another one of these, but yeah. And so now for the unfolding. Open both of these out. And also take this off. Forms a table. Okay, so I take this. Two seats. This back there. And this section will take off this off and forms a chalkboard. And open that up. And then lastly, open up this. So now, on to the little accessories is one of the newer spider pieces, so of course there. And also this chalkboard piece that uh, has booty on it and some different, and of course large stickers saying that and some other things onto it. And of course the odd things, those odd bricks down below. And of course, although the downfall is it's kind of it upside down so if you are to use this in a mock of course you'd probably just have to figure out how to attach it with some reverse studs of course but yeah reverse table which nice use of the double jumper piece and gold bar pieces in brown obviously. and also to the two seats of which just about the same as we've seen in the other Hogwarts moment set of course and table of which Done with some studs that are upside down, and of course jumpers underneath to probably be legs, of course, and also do get this couple of different things, probably like a plate or something, and a jar there, yeah. <coughs> and of course main highlight is this little chest piece, which lower part, same as most other treasure chests, but top part that is totally flat instead of like curved upwards, and also has two studs on it. Quite neat use of piece on there, which I would like to see used more often, of course. And of course, hinged on like other ones, but yeah. And look inside, and you get a micro fig. As of I, Mad Eye Moody again, of course. But although you do get two of this as an extra piece in this set, but although it's still nice to have here, of course. Okay. Right, so now to that, which still have the archway kind of design to it, and also this little section that's probably to be like some little light or something, but whatever. And also do get a few different uh, translucent pieces up down below representing different potions and jars and things. So, and also Nexo Knight's Pyramid, of course, in the center, some more of those things, and also a little fan on a sticker up there. And of course do get a golden cup piece and also skeleton leg in brown holding the traditional magnifying glass, of course. And on this section, one which that one larger piece of that has a sticker that holds a jar with a bunch of things in, it. and also underneath this small bone piece. Whoops. And on this wall, do you have a, a large sticker, something that sticks with some eyes on it, a couple of flames down below, and also a jar with a little spider in it, of course. And there's also a little archway that's made of just a few cylinders, and also another one of those pieces, and another one with a couple of magnifying glasses on them, of course. Other side of which, which is a little 
another sticker that was just a portrait and also one that what must be like some worms or snakes in there and also a shelf of different potions and things of course and on one side of which is another one large sticker that has large stained glass windows of course and also one that is another portrait and a few like shelves with potions and also dragon skull on it of course but yeah And also, you get small traditional Nexonites book piece in plain black, and also do you get the dark mark written right on, or right there, of course. So, quite cool. And of course, all the instructions say you can like slide it right on there, of course. So for my overall verdict, I think this is which a quite cool set. Like, do get the large book pieces in black, and of course, and also nice to get Mad Eye Moody in a, in a set instead of a CMF, which we haven't seen going on since like 2005 or so. And also good to have a microfig of him included as well. But yeah, and also plenty of good pieces to mention about again, like the new. A treasure chest piece, of course, but yeah. And also, well, despite being like a few pieces less than Deviation Class 1, but it still does well for the price and everything, but yeah. And so now if you're looking to get this, so if you're considering getting this set for your uh, Hogwarts Moment collection, well, definitely pick this up, and if you're looking for a good set with Mad Eye Moody and whatnot, well, also definitely pick this up. And that's about it for this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.